While Hoosier hysteria is taking over the 260, Crestview enjoying its own Buckeye Bonanza in Ohio. Ranked fourth in the state's Division IV poll, the Knights heading to the state semifinals for the second time in four seasons. And our man Josh Ayan checks in with Crestview as the Knights are bound for Dayton. We're all really close-knit group. We've been together for the past, more than just this past four years. It's been like our whole childhood, so I think that's really helped. Three years after reaching the state semifinals, Crestview is back on a familiar stage. This time, though, the Knights hoping to go to new heights. I've had support with my family ever since, you know, my older brothers have came through here and one state as well. So they've been they've been a great community. Good shot, fake Ellie. Leading the way for this Crestview program is Callie Gregory, who's actually coming to Fort Wayne next year to go play at the University of St. Francis. Gregory is continuing to rewrite the record books in her final season. She's got over 1900 career points, which is not only the best in Crestview program history between the boys and the girls, but also the best among all of Van Wert County. I'm just super thankful for all the teams I've had and just the bonding we've had, I think makes that happen. It's been it's been a lot of fun being able to coach her and being being dad, but also being coach and then to have Casey uh, and, and you know here as well and coaching her. And I know how much she has enjoyed playing with her, her older sister. And uh, yeah, it, it's a true blessing to be able to, to be a coach of all these girls, but especially my daughters. Just seeing being in that gym again, you know, it's a lot different from back here. So just the atmosphere and getting to see everyone there is pretty special. One, two, three, family, ready, break. Good job, ladies.